just like that when you were in your mother's belly. Isn't it interesting? So, how does the fetus first develop in the mother's womb? Wouldn't you like to know? Now, take out your lab note. Feel free to write your thoughts down. If you're not sure, you can put the video marker on top of the book. After watching an interesting video, it is good to summarize the contents in your lab note. Huh, let's go, boys. The time to meet the egg is almost here. There can be only one winner. Quickly, only the most diligent sperm will survive. Well, well, who will be the one for me out of all those sperms? I'm looking forward to meeting him. I'm waiting. When the sperm and egg meet, fertilization takes place and a new cell is formed. That cell is called a zygote. Once the zygote is safely placed in the mother's womb, the baby inside the womb begins to grow. If you would like to know more about how the fetus grows in the mother's belly, put a Mendel marker on the book. Finally, the fertilized egg is safely implanted. That fertilized egg is the baby in the mother's womb, the fetus. From then on, the fetus passes through the umbilical cord connected to the mother's body for about nine months. It is supplied with the substances necessary for the formation of the organs of the body and grows well. <coughs> Makes me sick.